It's that time of year for holiday parties, so today I'm going to be showing you guys my favorite hair, makeup, and an outfit idea for that perfect holiday look. So the first thing that I do for these curls is just put some heat protectant on my hair. Today I'm using the It's a 10 spray, but I just basically spray it into my hands, distribute it through my hair, and then brush my hair to get any knots out and further distribute the product. In terms of sectioning off my hair, I first like to split it into two sides, one on each side of my head, and then further distribute it into layers. Using my Conair Infinity Curling Wand, I take a small piece of hair, um, it really depends what size I take, I try to keep it around 2 inches or so, but sometimes it gets bigger, sometimes it's smaller. So I do the first half of my hair towards the top, um, not at the very top though, and curl it. And since my hair is long, I wait for that to heat up, and then I separately do my bottom half so that it creates an even curl. If I tried to do an entire section or strand of my hair all in one go on the curling iron, it ends up overlapping on top of each other, so some parts of it get more heated than others and it just doesn't create as even of a curl. So basically after that I just repeat that entire process all over my head and when I'm curling my hair I make sure that it's always going away from my face so that um, all the pieces like flow back nicely and frame my face well. Once I'm finished this is roughly what the curls look like. Once they have a little bit time to fall out and get loose I think they look really pretty. But yeah let's move on to makeup. I'm starting out with my Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel just to moisturize my face. Taking my Essence Cosmetics Tinted Moisturizer, I'm just putting a light layer of coverage onto my face. Then with my Laura Mercier Concealer, I'm just covering up some red spots on my face that aren't exactly cute. Then with one of my favorite powders, the Maybelline Dream Matte Powder, I'm just going over that tinted moisturizer and concealer to make sure that they don't move anywhere during this holiday party fun. Transitioning up to my eyes, the first thing that I'm doing is taking my Urban Decay Primer Potion and putting this onto my eyelids so that my eye look lasts a very long time. Next, grabbing my Mary Lou Manizer eyeshadow by the Balm and a large shader brush, I'm just putting this light shimmery color pretty much all over my eye um, on my lid and I extended it up to the crease. I wanted to keep this holiday look very simple and very fresh, so all I'm doing is just a light shimmery color on my eye. Additionally, taking a pointed crease brush, I put some of that color into my inner corner just to make my eyes really pop and glow. Next, taking Stila's Black Cajal Eyeliner, I line just the outer corners and a little bit further on the top of my eyes. I usually don't like using black eyeliner, but I think that when you use it minimally, it can really make your eyes stand out. Recently, I've been super into Benefit's Their Real Mascara. It makes your lashes look seriously amazing. Um, I got it as a sample at Sephora for my birthday. But anywho, I'm putting that mascara on first, and then I'm going to follow it up with CoverGirl's Lash Blast just to kind of further separate my lashes and p.s. I'm aware that my eyebrows aren't looking the cleanest right now I'm actually trying to grow them out a little bit because last time I got them done the lady waxed a little bit too much off so excuse that please <laughs> finally finishing off with my red lip look I'm taking my essence red lip liner and simply lining and lightly filling in my lips a good tip for not making your lips look super huge while lining them but still kind of enhancing their shape, go along the natural borders and gradually build. After that, I take my MAC Heartless Lipstick and a lip brush and simply apply that to my lips evenly. Feel free to add a lip gloss on top of the lipstick. I personally kept it without because I liked how it looks, but I think a really dazzling red color would look great. As for my outfit, I paired this embellished crop top that I got from Urban Outfitters recently. I love the silver embroidery on it. It's so super cute. Um, with my black favorite pleather skirt, I wear this all the time. Some sheer tights, my favorite black heels. And yeah, I think this outfit is like really festive, but at the same time, you're not like screaming red and green. I just love this holiday look, so I hope you enjoy it. I'll talk to you all very soon. Bye!